again, I'm Scott Galetti with this Lobo Football Camp report from Rui Doso. This report brought to you by La Quinta Inn and Suites at Rui Doso Downs in Rui Doso Downs, New Mexico. Lobo fans receive discounted rates all year long. Call them for details today. The University of New Mexico football team conducted two a days at camp in Rui Doso as they get ready for the 2011 season. There's an old saying, defense wins championships. New Mexico is counting on an improvement on the defense in 2011. In its new 4-2-5 formation, the defensive backs will be an important part of the Lobo defense this season. All Mountain West Conference pick Bubba Forrest anchors a new and improved secondary. Forrest collected 100 tackles last season with two interceptions. As part of being a senior and veteran around here, it's kind of my job to lead them, uh, show them how to do things around here. But for young guys, I'm real impressed with what they've been doing so far. But just talking either uh, in the meetings rooms or uh, out here on the field and just coach them up a little bit, whether it's alignment or the plays. And then after I do it a few times, they come up to me and ask questions. So it's great to be able to you know, help them out in that situation. Anthony Hooks posted 39 tackles, had one pick and forced two fumbles. He's out to show what he can do. Things are coming along great. Uh, we have a lot of depth. Uh, it's helping us develop and letting, letting the young guys learn and, and get ready just in case somebody goes down. But uh, we're, we're coming along very well, picking up the defense and just flying around, flying to the ball. I do, I've been around here for a while now and uh, Glover Quinn and DeAndre Wright took me under their wing and taught me a few things. So it's my turn to help the guys out and, and teach them a little bit as well. Deshaun Marmon is a key junior college transfer out of City College of San Francisco and brings significant experience to the table. A.J. Butler had two forced fumbles last year for the Lobo defense. He's ready to lead the charge. Oh yeah, we, we got the uh, quarterbacks back there holding the ball, scared to throw the ball because we deep in coverage. You know, we got every man covered up. And you know, that's a good feeling from last year. Deshaun Mills, who had 43 tackles a year ago, and Martez Barr are running with the ones. Uh, working with the ones, you know, um, got to have a sense of pride about it. You know, got to go out, compete, uh, practice every day, you know, work hard, um, try to represent your team the best way you can. It feels good, everybody flying. Like I said, everybody flying to the ball. We all getting there. Or 11 hats to the ball, it look good. We're going to make a lot of turnovers this year with five DBs on the field. New Lobo secondary coach Mike Woodford sees a lot of upside in his defensive backs. Woodford believes the Lobos are making significant progress. Right on that shoulder. Well, we're taking it one day at a time. We try to be better when we walk off the field than when we walked on. And uh, these guys are working hard. So uh, we're going to take it one practice at a time and try to get better every day. With the Lobo football team here in Ruidoso, sponsored by La Quinta Inn and Suites at Ruidoso Downs, I'm Scott Galetti for Lobo TV.